So this station we called Speak Out. It's our station um, that actually kind of brings everything together, but it's also independent from the other stations. What's great about this station is they are able to create something of their own that ties in with the idea of the civil rights movement and all the standards that we've talked about so far. The first thing that they're going to do is scan this QR code right here, which will lead them to a video of myself reading a section out of this book right here. It's called Art of Protest and it's by Day Nichols and it has a lot of great information on there but it's not really um, too grade standard for reading so I've just picked out just a section from them that specifically talks about youth leadership and how art is important to um, grassroots movements. So that's what that QR code is for. So after they've done that, then they have the um, daunting task of picking what they would like to make some art about. So we gave them a couple options here just for kids that might be a little overwhelmed with um, not as many guidelines to go off of. So some of the things that we chose, uh, something that's near and dear to my heart, climate change. Um, and climate change was the one that we chose to give an example on because I had already made one one time for a march. So that's that right there. And and it gives them a nice visual of what it might look like that they create. And then a couple of other options, school safety, um, standardized testing, which they would know as map testing, see what kind of their feedback, feedback is on that. And then after they've chosen that, we've got some art supplies here and some poster board. We would probably bring more to choose from or theoretically in your classroom, you would have an art supply section. You could just say, hey, go grab what you want from the art supply section. And before I forget, I wanna mention that we we do have a bus for this station as well, which Chantel made for us, and it'll probably be what we use to hold some of the smaller art supplies, but if nothing else, hey, doesn't it look great?